Hey wood gassers. Today I want to share with you my latest and greatest experiment. A common question that comes up is, how do I start my gasifier if the grid is down and I don't have electricity? Well, here's my answer to it. I've got a solar panel that's feeding DC power to that little shop vac and it's blowing a fan air ejector on the gas station. So let me take you over, I'm going to bounce you around a little bit and show you exactly what I've done. So first off, we'll, we'll take a look at the voltages. You can see that right now I've got 33.37 volts going to the shop back. Now that's just DC, there's no inverter, there's nothing. Because a vacuum cleaner has a universal motor, I can feed it AC, DC, anything I want. It just wants electrical power. Okay, over here, you can see I have the power, zoom back a little bit, I have the power from the solar panels coming into that little plug, and there's nothing to do any changes, no modifications. Okay, the shop back over here, I did take the filter out so it would flow more freely, but yeah, take a look on that. So, to prove to you that I am in fact running on just solar power, I'm now standing in front of the solar panel. And when I step back, she comes back to life. So, let's go over to the ejector now. Let's see if I can zoom in on the manometer. The manometer has been running. Let's see, can we see that? I'm not sure. The manometer's been running about three, three and a half inches of water in the zero flow condition. Now I have char in the gasifier, so when I open up the ball valve, hopefully you saw that you can see that the levels changed but not dramatically now, I'm still pulling a good two inches uh, of suction which you know is not great for a chip machine it's fine for a block machine a block machine can take off with that but it would definitely get the hearth lit and get things cooking you, know, you might you don't want to run that way for long because you'll end up with ash plugging but it will definitely get things going so hope you enjoyed talk to you later and have a good one